All right, we're over here just gauging at different types of baits at the moment. Kind of point out some stuff that I really love. I've always gone with Rapalas, which are really good brands, but as you can see, they're six dollars a piece. And if I'm gonna lose it, I kind of don't want to lose eight dollars at a time. Most people will be like, Oh, it's only eight dollars. Yeah, I know, but still, I don't like working with sinking ones, but I really like this one. I got another one of these shadow wraps, only it's yellow. Oh, actually, there it is. Shadow palette, green one and yellow. And of all these, now that, it's a super rogue. I don't, switch wick. Another one I've had great luck with is the XR10 X Rapala. It's got a really good coloration to it. I never run deep runners. Don't want to lose them all the time. Rattle trap's always a go-to. You need to run a little bit deeper. And of course, you gotta have some good booyahs with you. Strike King's not a bad brand. Haven't used them very much though. But one of my favorites over here is actually by this company, and they don't have the kind that I buy. They're the different Walmart, but they normally have two metal reflectors that come off the head oh yeah those never mind you got two shiners coming off each side and then you got your trailer on there and the weed guard don't forget if you use the weed guard you're gonna have to set set that hook and these believe it or not are dollar spinners and I have had some great luck with them like really good luck with these dollar spinners so it doesn't necessarily mean quality of tackle as much as it is if you can get a lure right in front of a fish, you're probably going to catch one. Now, other times they are picky, so that's why I have such a wide assortment of plastics and junk like that. I always like hitting the sale box. It's so much fun. It's like, ooh, what do they have in here now? White crawdads. I'm actually going to buy them because I don't have them. But just a range and gauge of different stuff you should buy. I've never even used one of these. They're the foot long worm. I don't know what kind of fish is going to hit that or how you would hook it if you had to put the hook you know, pretty close to the front. But I still buy a lot of this stuff. I'm going to have to try a lot of it out this next year. Rage Tail is always a great brand, especially with the coffee scent. It'll hold. The fish will grab it, get the flavoring, and hold on to it a little bit younger. So, hope y'all enjoyed this. Just a gauge at Walmart, what kind of fishing tackle you should buy. Shut your mouth.